New at noon, we are learning more about a Radford murder. The victim has been identified and search warrants describe the bloody scene officers saw when they arrived to find a Radford University student stabbed to death. Radford University student Alexa Cannon was found dead. She was a 2016 graduate of Patrick Henry High School in Roanoke. As we previously reported, 21 year old Louisa Cutting from Culpeper County faces a second degree murder charge in her death. 10 News reporter Tommy Lopez is live outside the Radford Police Department. Tommy, what do those search warrants say? They paint a gruesome picture of the crime scene that officers saw when they walked in on Thursday morning. The warrants say that Cutting answered her apartment door covered in blood. She turned around, put her hands behind her back and said, arrest me to officers. Officers were asking what was going on and she responded with, I killed her. So police walked into this apartment that the two share and they saw Cannon lying on the ground as we reported with multiple stab wounds. Today we learned from these warrants that Cannon also had a butcher knife sticking out of her mouth. We learned other details, including that her cell phone was under her left hand as police took that. They also took clothes and pictures and some other items. We've learned that we police do confirm that the two shared this apartment together. They were roommates. That is the apartment on Clement Street where this incident happened. Cutting was originally scheduled to appear in court today in just about an hour, but a court clerk says now that that is not happening today and there is not a date set as of now for Cutting's initial appearance. As we've reported, neighbors say they heard screams yesterday morning as this was happening. Many students say they're shocked by this. They say it's unexpected and the university president says this is a difficult time. We're working to learn more from police here at the department about the investigation, where it stands and if they're learning new details. And also we're speaking with the university about how they're responding. Live in Radford, I'm Tommy Lopez, 10 News, working for you.